ships underway this morning to remove a boat from the Sacramento River. Yeah, the 85 foot vessel caught fire in the water near the I-80 bridge nearly a month and a half ago. Rachel Wolf has been covering the story nearly the entire time and she joins us from West Sacramento with what crews are hoping to accomplish this time around. Hi, Rachel. Hi, so the city just told me that they're going to be taking this boat apart and removing it. Those operations already underway. As you can see, the barge and the tug with the crane in position to be doing that later on this morning. The Sacramento Fire Department doused the flames. The Sacramento County Sheriff's Office was brought in to investigate, and the California Department of Fish and Wildlife set up an oil spill response to get everything off the vessel, from fuel to batteries to any kind of hazardous materials. Since it happened, the state has been assessing the threat to the environment, then meeting with the homeowner to find out who is responsible. The owner of the boat is responsible to pay the bill. Um, at this point, we're still investigating to determine who's responsible. That'll, that'll be determined, but right now we are going to work to, to remove the, the threat with the contractor. Authorities told CBS 13 removal would not be handled by the fire department, the state, nor the Coast Guard, but likely a salvage company. All right, so I just got word from the city that Sacramento County put in an emergency request to the State Lands Commission for funding to remove the particular boat due to its compromised integrity after that fire and concern that it would be torn apart. The one-time funding to remove the boat comes from the commission's land bank fund. So again, how much is that going to cost? There's a press conference today at 10 a.m. that will be happening and we're going to get more information. Again, a number of environmental issues. This is a small boat, right? But there's been a number of different boats like this that have caught fire or capsized in the last 10, 20 years and getting them out of the river takes a process as we see. So uh, we'll be bringing that to you later on in the morning. Yeah, certainly a process, and it sounded like for a while no one really wanted to take ownership yeah. and responsibility for taking that out of the water. All right, thank you so much, Rachel, for that live update.